Hey, y'all, good morning. This is Coach Amy coming in to you. It's 8 a.m. here, but I still feel like it is super early. <laughs> oh, my gosh, I don't know what it is. When it's cold, it's just really hard to get moving. Let me have a little sip of coffee. Y'all comment hashtag grocery store. One of my group clients just texted me, you are just amazing. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Oh, good morning, Hazel. You're first. Okay, so I just went into um, one of our local grocery stores. This is a new one here. Um, it's called Corner Market, a special place to shop, it says. And um, I needed a few things, and I came out with a lot more, a lot more than a few things. So I wanted to share with you guys what I got. Um, whew, it's just a, a front seat full of fun over here. Um, okay, so let's see. First off. This is what I, I came for. I came for this. Um, some Kite Heel Dairy-Free Cream Cheese. This this is um, something that I like to have, especially during the holidays, because I do not like to have a lot of dairy. But a lot of holiday recipes have a lot of dairy in it. So if I can lessen the dairy or omit it completely from some recipes, that just makes my heart happy. Do I go extreme lengths to make that happen? I do not. But I do have two on hand now that I can use. Also in the dairy-free realm, this was there, and so I got that. Um, silk dairy-free heavy whipping cream for whatever I need it for. Um, and then this this is not dairy-free. <laughs> it's on cheese for my people. So something I'm going to tell you all about. What night was that? Saturday night, um, I made a potato soup for my people. Now, there are probably, good morning, Angela. There are probably a, a lot of bloggers, coaches, THM people that have made potato soup recipes. Um, I, I'm not on the potato train. I'm not on making cauliflower potato. They're not. Cauliflower is not potatoes. It's not. <laughs> and um, we can have potatoes on plan with Trim Healthy Mama. We're just going to do it wisely. I like to use a mix of golds and reds, and um, hey, Mandy Moore, good morning. I am uh, going to work through the recipe that I made because I am 99% sure it was an E. Um, <clears throat> I just haven't measured the fat that I added to it, so hang on to your knickers because I'm going to work on that, okay? But I did get a few things to go along with it because my family would add that cheese. That's why I got the cheese. That's the whole reason I told y'all that. Okay, anyway, I digress. Oh, what else did I get? Oh, yeah, celery. So I did put um, some celery in there, but honestly, I was trying to clean out my refrigerator when I made the recipe, but I had celery, and so I, I have that. I can use that. I can use celery for a whole bunch of things um, in my life, but it also goes in that soup I made. Hey, Carrie, good morning. Tell all my babies I love them. Y'all doing good? I got me some more of my favorite uh, cinnamon raisin Ezekiel bread in the freezer section at your favorite store, hopefully. I do like to have that. How do I have that on plan? As an E, I have two, and I put light Swiss laughing cow half on each side. Then I do a little gentle sweet and a little cinnamon, and I'll either have a yogurt or um, I eat like uncured Canadian bacon heated up with collagen in my coffee. I'll usually put some berries, uh, maybe a few grapes or something. So good. <clears throat> y'all are so funny. Yeah, that potato soup's coming at y'all soon. I'm not making any promises, but hopefully soon. What the heck is this? Oh, yeah, this is my ice cream. So, um, Saturday, sorry, all the rustling. <laughs> Saturday, our youngest daughter's going to be 14. Katie Elizabeth is going to be 14, and so she's having some friends over. We've got fun plans for tomorrow night for a little spend the night party, but Amy, Mama, oh, y'all need to see my shirt. This is Coach Amy. Oh, wait, this way. Oh, let me keep. Um, I'm going to need something on plan. My grand always, uh, usually, most of the time, makes my kids birthday cakes. Not They're not on plan. <laughs> um, and so usually, I just go grab some Rebel ice cream and call it a day. This is butter pecan, and they had it, so I got it, so I'm good. I'm going to have me a little, my own plan dessert while they have their cake, and it's going to be just fine. I don't need to go 
a hundred thousand extra miles and make me an own plan cake for her birthday. I can just have some ice cream that's on plan from the store. Drive through Sue, baby. <laughs> okay. Um, <clears throat> extreme wellness, low carb wrap, personal choice. This is tomato basil. I do enjoy this with my pesto pizza from Trim Healthy Future. If you don't have that cookbook, you ought to get it. Um, so I do use those from time to time. My family will eat most of these um, tortillas, but um, I did get the whole grain, whole wheat ones also. And that's the carb balance one um, on plan personal choice. This is not on plan, but my family does use these. Not on plan, not on plan, not on plan. My family uses this. Okay, so that's, that's the bag of wraps. Um, I didn't. I had a Walmart grocery order yesterday, but I neglected to put those in my buggy. My buggy. Okay, we'll see what else I got. Oh yeah, I got some cucumbers. The cucumbers that were delivered yesterday to my house from Walmart um, were not good, so I've got to send a thing in to get my money back. Um, so I got a couple of English cucumbers because we eat those a lot, and then I got these mini ones for the boys to take in their lunchbox um, tomorrow. Uh, I did have like a plain old regular garden type cucumber that we had. So I just peeled it for the boys and sliced it up for their lunch today. And it's going to be fine. It's going to be just fine. Okay. Um, I did get these. These are personal choice. Drive through Sue. Yumminess. I have plans for these. Thanksgiving, my mother-in-law um, has camp, my oldest son, come by and they always make what we call turtles so it would be this would be off plan okay don't get you don't get too excited <clears throat> so it's a little twisty pretzel a rollo and a pecan and you melt you do with the thing and you melt it and it's all it's delicious those were very tempting for me at thanksgiving just saying and so um i decided i think i could make those on plan so my plan is to lay these on parchment paper and smush a pecan on top. And so I'll have like a kind of sort of turtle, but without the pretzel. And I'm really excited about that. If y'all have any ideas on something I could sub for the pretzel, I'd love to hear it. But right now, I think I'll be okay with the dark chocolate covered caramel and the, pre and the pecan. Like, I think that would toot my horn just fine. Okay. All right. What else do I have in here? Um, I've not tried the Mary's Gone Crackers. Um, what is this? Black pepper. I have not tried this. Um, several of these, the Mary's Gone Crackers in this smaller box, are on plan. Some of them are more crossover. Some of them are getting really close to being a crossover. So just look at your label, girls, okay? You could also do sprouted. Yes, and that, this, the, is it, oh, no. What's the name brand of that? Or is it Sprouts? Is it from Sprouts, a grocery store? I, we don't have that here. Anyway, that would make it a crossover to me. I'd rather just, I'd rather just have that caramel and chocolate and pecan. I really think I'll be fine with that. But good idea, good idea, Stacy. Anyway, they, I did see some other Mary's um, crackers. Unique, that's right. Um, <clears throat> I saw some more other of these, and I grabbed them to look. They were not on plan. It's a taller box, um, and they're like thins or crisp or something. It was another word. So be be careful um, when you're at the store looking for those. Um, this is something that I do like to have um, if we are traveling, and Wes used my last one. So I just grabbed two of these. They are 100% on plan, and I really like having them in the in a pinch type situation. Um, this is something that I do like to have also on the go, or if, if I'm just needing some chocolate, that kind of thing. This is 100% on plan, Lily's. It does have the chicory root fiber that could hurt your tummy, maybe, maybe not. I don't do it often, but... I like having them at my house. That is, that is nothing y'all want to see. Let's see. All right. I got some green onions for the potato soup. Boom. So I'm excited about that. Oh, I got some stocking stuffers while I was at the grocery store. These are hot hand, hand warmers. They were a dollar a pack for all my hunters. It'll go in their stocking. Don't tell them. Shh, it's a secret. <laughs> and I have one more bag. It's the vital part of potato soup. Y'all ready? I already have the potatoes. I already have that. I got me a ham, y'all. Boom. I go ham. Brianna Thomas has a delicious brown sugar glaze for a ham. Check her out. She'll hook you up with that. 
And so I'll put that, and I, I put it in my, um, I have a beautiful blue Pampered Chef cast iron uh, Dutch oven pot thing. Anyway, it's huge. And um, that's how I cooked my ham for Thanksgiving. And it was, it worked out perfectly. I actually tip, I used my rack from my Instant Pot in the bottom, and then I did the ham. And that way it didn't like get stick stuff stuck. It didn't get stuck. Yeah. That's it. That's all I have to show y'all. Um, thanks for watching. It was good to be back in the parking lot with y'all. Um, do you notice that I have a little bit of a new vehicle? I don't know if y'all can tell. I have a new, I got a, I got a Jeep. <laughs> I have been wanting a Jeep since I was in high school. And Wes and I talked about it mid-October. And a few weeks ago, I did a simple, well, there was one local here. It wasn't the color I wanted. And I went to go test drive it, but it had been, like, sold that day, and so I couldn't test drive it, but I got to sit in it, and I was like, okay, okay. Um, and I didn't want to just, like, order one. I don't even know how that works. That blows my mind. We don't we don't buy brand new things. We, we buy used. That's something we've always done. Anyway, TMI, probably. But um, I just had never driven a Jeep. I, the idea of it was super precious to me, but um, I didn't know if I was going to like it or not. So. I just did a simple search one Saturday night late. Ivy Francis likes your two blades. Hey, Ivy Francis. Thank you. I miss her. Um, <clears throat> it's because Coach Amy's hair was wacko, jacko this morning. <laughs> it got braided. Um, but anyway, so on the Jeep, y'all, I searched it on Facebook Marketplace. I was like, what the, what the heck? Let's try it out. And there she was. Woo! Great price. Great year, great mileage, all the things that Wes had said would be great to have. It was just, like, wonderful. So we went the next day and test drove it. It was about an hour and a half away, um, and it was all my dreams were made of, and <laughs> I got it the next week. So I'm super excited to have this. It is um, some of our close friends have like, did you get rid of the expedition? I'm like, oh, no, I got five kids. <laughs> I know. So anyway, we are enjoying it. The girls have not driven it yet. They were nervous to drive it. So, anyway, Lily did drive it to the end of the driveway. But um, I've enjoyed driving it. It's been great. So, I hope y'all have a great day. Hope you enjoyed my live grocery haul from the parking lot from Corner Market. And um, I'll be hopefully in touch with you all very soon for my potato soup recipe. Um, and my, my family will be happy because they ate it up. Like, there weren't even... There was like a cup of leftovers. I was honestly like, somebody just needs to finish this off. <laughs> but um, it made a huge pot. Everyone was happy. And I was thrilled that I got to feed my family something yummy. Y'all have a great day. And I will see y'all later. Happy December, y'all. Bye. I can't find the button. <laughs>